A long waited labor protection amendment to prevent death and illness from overworking has cleared the legislature. It will require employers to take measures to prevent the overwork of staff. The amendment was made to the Labor Safety and Health Act. A major change is in the name with the labor switch to occupational. This reflects expansion of the amendment to more industries. A new anti-fatigue clause stipulates that employers must implement work shifts. And for those who work long hours, preventative measures need to be implemented to prevent fatigue. Otherwise, employers will be fined up to 150,000 NT. Employers will also be responsible for laborers who experience occupational diseases with a maximum fine of 300,000. And for workers often work overtime, as long as a physician identifies their affliction as being an occupational injury, employers will be fined but not held criminally responsible. Despite passage of the amendment, many have mixed feelings. A human life cannot be bought for 300,000 NT. Is this consistent with social justice? This should not be something settled with a fine because employers are not afraid of fines. The Amendment Act is not 100 percent perfect, but it really is the most significant update in 23 years. Most agree that the new law is a big step forward in protecting the rights and interests of local workers.